Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Today we will discuss about what an orifice plate is all about and what is its working principle and what is an orifice effect. Okay, so guys, an orifice plate is a device used for measuring flow rate, or else you can say uh, it's a device used for reducing uh, pressure uh, in a fluid medium. Okay, and this orifice plate is also called as restrict restriction plate because mm, the main function of the orifice plate is to restrict flow so friends the this is uh, what an orifice uh, does okay uh, here do you can have a look uh, at a sketch wherein you will see an orifice plate fitted in a pipe wall okay see this is a pipe uh, which has got certain thickness and uh, the left end of the uh, pipe portion is called as upstream and the right end is called as downstream so you can uh, uh, look carefully uh, here there is a fluid flow and uh, this d1 is the uh, diameter of the pipe and uh, d2 is the orifice diameter and uh, uh, here you can see dvc this is the vena conductor diameter okay and as there is a fluid flow uh, through this uh, piping system uh, okay as when when a fluid starts flowing through this pipe and as and when it reaches the orifice plate portion uh, the pressure will uh, increase because of the restriction of the orifice plate okay and as and when it passes through the uh, this vena conductor which is a uh, conversion to diverging section okay what will happen is that once it exceeds this uh, this uh, uh, orifice plate uh, section there will be a tendency of pressure uh, reduction uh, and uh, the velocity will uh, get increased so this is what uh, an orifice plate does uh, in a uh, fluid medium okay friends now you can uh, see a glance at this uh, image wherein you can uh, look at uh, the orifice plate uh, uh, representation okay see this is a orifice plate okay it has got tap handle and this is the circular suction which is called as a orifice plate and it has got certain thickness maybe the thickness vary from 0.8 to 1.6 mm okay and in between you will uh, find an opening provided okay uh, I, I mean the, uh, a hole provided uh, in the center of this uh, plate this is called as an uh, ho hole okay and uh, just below this opening you will, uh, you will see a um, small hole used for draining purpose also and please do have a look at this um, orifice plate uh, flow meter uh, this case this is also a piping system wherein you can see a orifice plate this is the orifice plate fitted in the fitted in the uh, piping uh, piping system okay and this left end of the portion is called as upstream and right end of the portion is called as downstream okay and uh, this is the uh, orifice diameter and this orifice diameter will be always lesser than the main diameter of the pipe okay and uh, here what is happening is that uh, in a fluid system suppose let us assume that a fluid is flowing through this upstream okay so obviously um, this fluid will be having certain pressure what will happen is that uh, as and when this fluid uh, fluid uh, flow reaches this um, orifice plate area there will be a restriction uh, provided by this orifice plate uh, mm -hmm. because of that uh, the pressure will get increased at this position while uh, while this fluid flow um, uh, just um, comes uh, nearer to this orifice plate area and after that what happens is that once it exceeds the orifice plate section there will be a uh, reduction in pressure as a result of increase in velocity so the main function of the orifice plate is to uh, reduce a pressure okay and in uh, in hydraulic system and this fluid uh, medium application uh, the, uh, you, you may find a, a situation wherein you, uh, you need a higher pressure at some uh, area and uh, after this uh, orifice applied orifice plate area you may require a, a lesser uh, a pressure so these orifice plates are uh, provided in such areas wherein uh, you need to have a differential process okay so friends uh, this is what an orifice plate does the main function of an orifice plate is to uh, restrict flow uh, thereby uh, reducing pressure uh, um, and as i said uh, when uh, the upstream uh, fluid uh, uh, reaches this orifice area uh, there will be increase in pressure and, in, and it exceeds the orifice uh, section there will be a 
reducing pressure as a result of increase in velocity okay friends and uh, here uh, you will uh, obviously find a difference in pressure because here um, uh, this surface plate is uh, fitted in between the upstream and downstream uh, in a uh, uh, piping system so what will happen since there is a flow uh, and uh, uh, because of the restriction provided of the surface plate there will be a difference in pressure uh, on both side upstream and uh, downstream obviously on upstream uh, upstream you will find higher pressure and uh, in downstream you will find lesser pressure okay okay friends now let's see what this orifice effect is all about okay friends okay friends now here you can same the similar uh, situation wherein you can see uh, this is the upstream area and uh, this middle portion is the um, area where uh, an orifice uh, plate uh, is being fitted and this is the downstream okay so and uh, this uh, this is just a schematic representation uh, arrangement made by me just to explain the uh, after effects of an orifice effect okay so here uh, this is the upstream and this is the downstream so what will happen is that if there is a fluid flow and as and when it reaches it uh, passes through this upstream and it reaches this orifice area so this is uh, this is the area middle, this middle portion is the area wherein an orifice plate is fitted so what happens is that as and when it reaches uh, this orifice uh, plate area there will be an increase in pressure uh, uh, there will be an increase in pressure which is being created just because of the restriction uh, provide restriction uh, restriction in flow uh, because of this orifice plate fitted in between this middle portion okay and after it this uh, exceeds this uh, uh, this orifice area there will be a reduction in pressure resulting in increase in velocity and this middle portion an orifice plate is fitted actually uh, the orifice uh, orifice plate uh, is provided with an opening in the center and it will be having a uh, convergent divergent section because of that uh, when the food um, uh, just uh, enters this orifice area there will be a restriction to the fluid flow because and uh, as a result the increase in pressure on the upstream upstream side is getting reduced as as a result of pressure drop and uh, because of this result of pressure drop there will be increase in uh, velocity which will again result in uh, pressure reduction on this side so here obviously there is uh, there is a fluid flow uh, on both sides so uh, in the upstream side there will be more more pressure and the downstream side there will be less pressure okay friend now let us assume that here i am blocking uh, this upstream and uh, sorry downstream side uh, with a uh, i am closing it okay then what will happen see friend uh, this is also a similar situation wherein i have blocked the downstream stream now what will happen that the fluid will, even uh, the fluid will uh, flow uh, flow through uh, this piping system but again as and when it's, uh, even though this orifice plate is provided what will happen that fluid is uh, flowing through this orifice plate and uh, since here there is a restriction uh, here i am just blocking the flow what will happen that uh, uh, there will not be any pressure difference created because even though the uh, there is flow through this upstream and downstream um, there is no pressure difference getting created because it has been uh, closed there is a restriction over this uh, so pressure uh, in this under uh, system will remain same uh, so as per uh, as suggested by as per the pascal's law we all know that the pressure in a closed system remains same so here by blocking this uh, downstream side there will not be any pressure difference created even though an orifice is provided so friend this is what an orifice effect is all about so so the main function of an orifice plate uh, and uh, the purpose of uh, it is to restrict the flow rate in a hydraulic system or a fluid uh, fluid system uh, and uh, this fluid uh, this orifice plate acts as a uh, flow restriction device uh, wherein you will be able to um, adjust the pressure i mean uh, uh, you can uh, increase the pressure as well as reduce the pressure in a hydraulic system wherever you need a higher pressure on uh, some area and uh, lesser pressure on uh, some other area other section on this on that cases you will be able to provide this orifice plate
okay friends so this is what an orifice is all about and its function and the orifice effect is all about so guys hope you all might have enjoyed this video session and if you find it uh, informative i would request you all to like share and subscribe my channel uh, i will again see you later with a new video thank you